Oh, hello. How nice of you to join me. As you guys can see, I'm a little low on funds. $186,000 just doesn't cut it for me, you guys. So today, I am gonna go on the greatest robbing spree ERLC has ever seen. So the truth here is that there's already three other players in the map. I presume they're doing the exact same thing I am doing, which is going around and taking advantage of the fact that this server is not quite full yet. I don't even know as I was talking what difficulty I selected. I hope I at least selected normal. God, this is going a little too slow for my taste. Even for me, this is too easy. Wow. All right. $2,900. Oh, I must have picked easy or something. I don't know what I picked. Yikes. All right, you guys. But the point of this video is, again, to go on this robbing spree. I'm going to try to make away with at least maybe fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000, maybe a little bit more. We'll see. Depends on how it goes. I really hope none of these players currently on the map turn into a cop because I would really ruin my plans. So let's go check out the bank. We're not too far from it. Oh, and it looks like somebody's already in there. No, come on, man. Let me do it. Yeah. Oh, wow. All right. Let me head to the jewelry store. And I should have paid a little bit more attention to how it started because don't forget, we are also getting a kicker for being part of the mafia and being part of the group. So here we go. This case has recently been robbed. Oh, these guys are really foiling my plans right now. Yes, they sure are. Yeah, if this keeps happening, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna turn into a cop for a few minutes, go chase them around, just enough to spook them, maybe get them to leave the server or something, and then I'll be back to commit my own robberies, because this whole thing about waiting around for robberies is not gonna work out for me. Alright, there is $2240 for me though. Going on to that second case now. Another $1800 and my drill is done. Gonna drive around the corner and hit a house next. Not really feeling ambitious here and I don't want to ruin my chances. I want to maximize my opportunities. So I'm going to do the normal difficulty on this one. The housing robbery is not always the easiest and here we go. Thankfully I got in. Oh, there is a safe. No, why is there a safe? All right, I guess we'll do the normal here as well. And target numbers are 40 to begin, got it. 80 coming around, got it. 40 once again, got it. And then 90 to wrap it up. Oh no, and there's 10, there is one more, and I got it. That is 6,100 in the safe. Thankfully, I got it. Let's move on to the next robbery. All right, Zanies, and this isn't working out for me. I am having to wait for robberies, despite there only being three players in the map. Obviously, this is not as fast as I would like it to be, so I'm going to do something here. Not only am I going to kill this guy, but hopefully, he gives me an opportunity. Get out of here, bro. Leave. And that wasn't very nice of me, but I'm going to take his cash. There we go. All right. Well, I made about a thousand dollars robbing him. Hopefully he doesn't come back after me, though. I'm going to give it one more shot, sort of just sticking around. And yeah, you guys see yet another ATM was robbed yet another robbery. I have to wait for it. And who's this guy here? I'm going to get him as well. You can't run, bro. Where'd you go, man? Where'd you go? I know you're around here somewhere. Leave. All right, that's all fun and games, but that's not gonna net me any real money, you guys. I gotta focus here. I really gotta get to robbing. Still waiting on the bank, but while I do, this ATM should be ready for me. I'm gonna try my luck at the hard level, and here we go. Gotta focus here. Yes, and I got it. 64.27, a total of a little over $8,000 for me on that one. Back at the jewelry store. 18.95 on that one. Twenty three sixty eight on that one, and I should have two more left in me. Twenty two fifty two on that one, and last one, boys and girls. 
Ah, and we didn't go four for four in the jewelry store. I knew I should have gone for an easier level on that one. It's okay though. We still made some pretty good money in the jewelry store. Not normally the case. Let's go see if the bank is finally ready for us. And no, he hit the bank. This isn't working out for me, guys. It just really isn't. And I finally got my shot at the bank, but my biggest problem here is that I ended up getting into a scuffle with those two guys. I ended up spending entirely too much time trying to hunt them and fight them. And now I don't even have a car as I'm committing this robbery in the bank. So I don't know how much money I'm going to get away with, but if I hit anywhere close to 240, I will be done for the day, you guys. I promise. That is all I want. Not trying to get too greedy here, but already this gas is setting in and I wasn't at the best health to begin with. So this is probably not going to end too well for me. I got to be honest. We'll see though. Going to go after one more stack after this one and we are at 22. Yeah, I got to hurry here. That gas is really going to begin setting in. And here we go. We are off. Okay, not going to waste any time. Hopefully there's no one out there, but I guess there will be. We'll see. Yeah, and there he is. I don't know if he's friendly or foe, but I'm not going to risk it. I got to get out of here. Bro, what do you want? Are you a cop? Is that a cop? Please don't be a cop. I think that's a cop. Oh, I think it is a cop, bro. Please don't. Oh, no. I'm going to run out of stamina. Hold on. Keep running, Zany. Keep running. I need 12 Robux. Keep running. Yes, my stamina has been filled. Let's go. I'm going to run in the most straight line possible in order to get out of here. Bro, please don't. Why are you doing this? I might have to refill my stamina a couple more times to make sure I get away from this cop. Bro, why are you doing this? Don't do this. I think I've gained some distance from him, but I'm not entirely sure. Bro, don't, man. Don't. I didn't even realize he was a cop. I got to spawn a vehicle. I don't even care which one. I just got to get out of here. All right. And just like that, I am making my getaway Yikes, that was a close one, and I didn't even realize it. So we're at 224 after all the paychecks, after all the robberies. I do have about a seven minute cooldown period, and I really want to get to that 240 mark. If I get to that 240 mark, I will be pretty happy. That'll be roughly what, maybe 50, $60,000? And I'd be pretty happy with that. Let me pull up to this ATM here and hit it real quick. And I have to go after the hard. That's going to be the only way I'm going to close on my target. And I ended up getting it for $58.96. That was a close one. Those top numbers really do get me. I don't know what it is about them. But thankfully, I'm making away with it. And now I am closer to that 240 mark at 231. I want to hit the jewelry store one more time. But with that cop sort of trolling the city center, I don't know if I want to risk it. We'll see them. And I'm just going to go for the normal on this one, you guys. I just want to be done and over. So here we go. That last pin. Perfect. Let's make entry. No, please don't be a safe. Okay, perfect. It's not a safe. Just like that. We are at 232. I should be looking for three more stacks at least. There's three. There's four. And there's five. Perfect. Five stacks, 236. That is a healthy sum of money. This means that I just got to hit one more ATM, and after I hit this last and final ATM, I'll go into my cooldown period and officially be done with my robberies. All right, Zanies, we are finally in on this normal difficulty. Should be able to get this one, no problem. EDE, 54A, BD3. Where are you at? Oh, I see you there in that bottom corner. 47F. 1BF. And boy, these normal difficulty ones just seem so much easier after doing the hard ones. And 4311, I am officially, I am officially over my $240,000 mark, you guys. I need to cool down for four minutes, and that is going to do it. You know, I think it would be really cool to kind of work my way up to a million dollars. You know what? 
I think I'm going to start a series called On My Way to a Million Dollars in ERLC, and all I'm going to do is rob. Maybe that'll be like, I don't know, maybe I'll make that like a Wednesday bonus video or something. Maybe where I don't even give that much commentary and just focus on robbing. So let me know down in the comments below if you guys want to see that mini series. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, long live the zanies. By the way, zanies, it's that time of year. We are quickly approaching the end of 2022 and thus will mark the end of the 2022 zany official hoodie. They're currently still only 10 Robux, very inexpensive. Remember, new official zany hoodies are made every single year. And once the new batch is released and dropped, the old batch will skyrocket all the way to 100,000 Robux, making the previous collection a true collector's item. Make sure you're an early owner of all this official zany merch and in case you guys don't know all of this merch can be found in the roblox avatar store directly or you guys can join the group and shop the store directly from the group in either case this is the only way to get your official zany merch you have until the end of december and come january 1 the new merch will be dropped and i cannot wait to show you guys the new design of the official zany hoodie